Alright lads, so today we're going to be reviewing Silver Inform, Nicholas Hellenius, plays for Aalborg in the Danish Superliga, he's 6 foot 5 tall, right footed, he's got medium medium work rates, a 3 star weak foot and 2 star skills. Looking at his in games, his standouts are 82 penalties, 81 free kick accuracy, 81 heading, 80 shot power and 77 long shot. I've also included all the upgrades over his non inform as a comparison for you, so you can see each individual stat increases of all those stats, so you can always pause the video if you want a close look at any of them. So this is the team we were using Inform Hellenius in, a 4-2-3-1 Super League team with Inform Hellenius at striker. So now onto the gameplay so you can see how he was performing it. So I'm sure Villa fans will remember Hellenius, especially after uh, Jan Vertonghen pulled his shorts down. Always remember that game where he was clean through, pulled his shorts down, should really have been a penalty. Now in game Hellenius has got some decent stats to be honest and he does make a great target man. He's got his great 6 foot 5 height and does have surprisingly good feet and did have decent dribbling on him for such a big man. Passing was not too bad either so great for hold up play in that target man role. Feed it into him he can hold the ball up then release the pass to your runners. And his pace did not feel all that bad at all, was certainly no slouch. Did do a good job at bursting away from defenders as well, did actually have a get a nicer bit of acceleration on him. Not too bad, plenty of times were actually running through. Defenders were struggling to keep up, they were keeping level but he did manage to actually hold them off and get in for the finish. And he was great at finishing his chances in the box. Does have his 80 shot power as well. So does have a decent shot on him. And most of the chances, he was just tucking them away. Most chances, he did convert in the box. So I cannot complain at all with his finishing. Really actually surprising how well he was able to tuck him away. A couple of negatives are his medium, medium work rates, which I do not like as a striker. But it, to be honest, it wasn't too bad. With him being a lone striker, he wasn't dropping too deep. Did that actually stay around in his striker position quite well does only have two star skills as well so you are going to be limited to ball rolls and fake shots to get you through but we still managed to cope fine we did do well with Hellenius up top now he is a great aerial threat as well with that six foot five height and great heading accuracy he can get up to meet headers now he does have poor jumping but that height is a great counter for it not a lot of defenders were beating Hellenius in here and did manage a couple of nice headed finishes really really did perform better than I was actually expecting which is always a good thing Go in with low expectations, it's always great when you're surprised. So let's have a look at Inform Hellenius' performance stats. So in six games, he did manage to bag 12 goals and got one assist. All his stats on the left, goals are on the right, position map shows you where goals are scored and assists were created as well. So overall, we're giving Inform Hellenius a great 8.7 out of 10. Really, really loved using Inform Hellenius. Does make a great target man, which I do like to play with. 4-2-3-1 is one of my formations. I always tend to do, uh, and I do love using those big target men up top, especially when they've got uh, good feet as well and decent passing. Makes them a dream to use. Now, it does have decent finishing. As we said, great finishing. Was pretty clinical in front of that box. Great shot power. And of course, he's got his good early ability as well and his free kicks to uh, add on to that as well. It is a bit of a shame about his medium, medium work rates and his two-star skills, but we still managed pretty damn well up top as a lone striker. Was really great to use. I highly recommend you going out and try and inform Hellenius. So finally, we're just going to leave you with Inform Hellenius' positives and negatives to look at. Now, his price range is only 15 to 25k, so for me, that is a bargain. If you're thinking about him, go out and get him. Go and try him. I'm sure you'll get on with him. We got on with him great. And you can make a pretty decent Danish Super League team to go around him as well for him to play in. So hopefully you did enjoy this review. If you did, please leave a like. It does help out a lot. We try to do the most in-depth reviews as we can on YouTube. Please subscribe if you're new to the channel. Loads more to come. Loads more to check out. So stay tuned for them. Thanks a lot for watching, lads. Cheers, lads. See you later.